Well, you must have dreamt something in the past. You must have felt something in the past. You must have thought some things in the past. And those things, those feelings, those dreams are gonna become a reality at this point in time when Jupiter and Rahu are together in the Aries sign. You know, Jupiter and Rahu are gonna stay in the Aries sign from the 22nd of April 2023 until 30th of November 2023. So during this time, your thoughts, your feelings, your dreams are gonna become a reality at this point in time. You know, you would be seeing some things in your life which you must have thought of. If you had thought of going abroad, if you have thought of getting married to a good girl, if you had thought of getting married to a good boy, if you had thought of getting married to a good man or a woman. So at this point in time, all your wishes and desires are gonna get fulfilled at this point in time when Jupiter and Rahu are together. You know, Rahu is an illusion and Jupiter is all about righteousness. It is all about reality. Rahu is an illusion, but Jupiter gives you things which are real in this world. Actually, nothing is real in this world. This world is an illusion. But technically speaking, you are gonna see dreams becoming a reality which you had just thought of or planned about and things will manifest in your life at this point in time. And when things manifest in your life, that means you are gonna see a change in your life. You are gonna see a transformation in your life. You are gonna see some things which you hadn't seen before. You could have a feeling of deja vu at this point in time. You know, you'll experience certain things in your life which you might have thought of or you might have dreamt of. You know, you might experience some things in your life and those same things are gonna give you a sense of deja vu at this point in time. Something which you always desired, something which you always wished can become a reality at this point in time. You know, in life, when some things happen in your life which you thought is impossible, then you have that feeling that these things which are happening to you are miracles. You know, I believe in miracles. Miracles are the things that God does for you, through you, as you and with you. And when those miracles happen, then you say, look at God. It increases your faith, belief and admiration for that almighty God. You know, you must continue to dream at this point in time. You know, your dream is a better future for you, for your family, for your life for your career. So don't stop dreaming at this point in time. You know, where you wanna go, what you wanna do, what you wanna be, what you wanna see, what you wanna experience are all your dreams. So don't let your dreams die at this point in time. Make a conscious, deliberate and a determined effort to fulfill all your desires and wishes at this point in time. You know, Time is passing and time is not stopping for you nor me. So you need to utilize your time at this point in time because tomorrow might not come. No one has seen tomorrow. Let me tell you, the best day of your life is today. If you don't believe me, try missing this day. You will realize then when you miss a particular day. By missing that particular day, I mean you are not on this planet earth. So try to utilize your time at this juncture. Because as I told you, that today is the best day of your life. You've got to dream dreams. You know, without dreams and vision, people perish, people will die. If there is no dream in this world, people are gonna perish, people are gonna die. So keep that dream alive at this point in time because you've got to have something in your mind which inspires your heart and soul. You know, if you take crumbs from the starving soldiers, they won't die. If you take bread from hungry children, they won't cry. But without dreams, we all will die. 
so keep those dreams alive at this point in time you know people might discourage you from fulfilling your dreams at this point in time they might talk negative about your dreams at this point in time they might discourage you at this point in time they might tell you that you are not good enough to fulfill your dreams they might tell you that this is very tough for you they might tell you that things are not going to work the way you are planning it would work for you don't listen to them at this point in time don't listen to those negative people at this point in time stop listening to these kind of people at this point in time and listen to your heart because where your heart is there your treasure is also so you need to keep dreaming at this point in time and try to manifest your dreams by working hard at this point in time you know nothing will work unless you do if you don't move the world will not move for you so you need to make a conscious deliberate and a determined effort to work at this point in time you know trust no future however pleasant let the past bury its dead work work in the living present with heart within and god overhead so you need to work with that faith with that belief that your work is going to pay you rich dividends whoever whatever other people are telling you about your life about your career about your work about your life don't listen to them at this point in time listen from one year and take it out from the other you don't need to bother about such people who are trying to destroy your dreams don't let others destroy your dreams because these are your dreams this is your life and you have to decide what you have to do with your life well i am not telling you all not to take suggestion and advices take suggestion and advices from everyone but do what your heart tells you to do you know what people think about you is not important what you think about yourself is important your perspective about yourself matters not what other people are thinking about you you know whatever you do whatever you say people are going to say and think things about you they will say something about you they will think about you if you do something if you try to move forward in your life if you make an effort to change your life they will talk about you they will think about you they will gossip about you and when people do this that means you are on that road to success if people are talking about you if people are gossiping about you that means you are on that road to success so if people are thinking about you talking about you gossiping about you that is a perfect indication that you are going to succeed in the future you know the other thing which i want to tell you all is that the change which you are going to experience at this point in time you must embrace that change you must embrace that change with both your arms because this change which is going to come would be better than what you were doing in your life you know at this point in time you might suffer you might feel some pain at this point in time but let me tell you when the pain to remain the same is greater than the pain to change you will change i repeat when the pain to remain the same is greater than the pain to change you will change so at this point in time you will endure some pain and suffering but that will prompt you to change your life at this point in time you know everything must change and everything will change and everything is changing and evolving continuously and this is how the law of the universe is this is how the law of the world is that everything must change change is inevitable nothing remains the same so at this point in time you need to go with the flow of life at this point in time if you are experiencing that change in your life trust me and remember that that change is going to be better than what you had been experiencing in the past
You know, some people fear that change in their life, but it is not always for the worst. So at this point in time, you are going to experience a change which will be better than what you were experiencing earlier. Well, I was talking about dreams some times ago. You know, you have the right to dream in your life. You have the right to fulfill your dreams in your life. Nobody has the authority to destroy your dreams in this life. And you need to believe that you can make it happen in this life. You know, whatever a mind can conceive and believe, it can achieve. Well, why not you? You have the brains. You can make decisions. You can study the plan. You can change your life. You can grow immensely in the next few years. You can make your dreams come true. You know, no one is gonna come in and do it for you. Only you can change your life. Only you can make your dreams manifest in your life. And this is the time to take that dream and make it a reality. Don't let your dream die in you at this point in time. Take this dream and breathe into your own personal spirit until finally it becomes a flame that burns around the world. You need to do it now. You need to make your dreams reality just at this point in time when Jupiter and Rahu are together in the Aries sign. You know, we join a dream because we believe in it. We stay in that dream because we are committed to those dreams. We leave those dreams because we get disillusioned. We come back into that dream because we were lost without that dream. So keep dreaming. Make an effort to fulfill your dreams at this point in time when Rahu and Jupiter are together in the Aries sign. Well, this is all I wanted to tell you all about Jupiter and Rahu in the Aries sign. If you want some specific predictions about yourself, then you may contact me directly. Well, like I always say, that if you wish to know your future through astrology and you are determined to live the best possible version of yourself, well, one must always try to live his or her best version of themselves because there is only one life to live. There are no duplicates of a life. You will never get a chance to live this beautiful life once again. And if you want to enhance your luck in your life, if you want to boost your luck in your life, if you want to increase and improve your luck in your life, then let me tell you that I have several remedies for you. You know, these remedies which I'm talking about are a fusion of astrological remedies, Vastu remedies and religious remedies, which can be utilized by any person of any religion, because I believe that there is only one God in this universe. And if you want me to pray for you, because prayer can move mountains. So if you want me to pray for your health, wealth, success, money, business, career, job, relationships, love relationships, marriage, married life, children, property, education, etc, 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 then also you may contact me. You may also contact me for a Vastu visit of your flat, office, residence or factory. Or if you want one Vastu instrument, which can solve all your Vastu problems in your house, home, factory, office, etc, etc, etc. Then also you can contact me. And if you are hell-bent on taking your life from the ridiculous to the sublime, from the low point to the high point, from nothing to something, then you may contact me over WhatsApp. My WhatsApp number has been given on this video. Have a great day and a great life ahead. God bless you. Jai Matadi. Jai Ma Kali.